Joining us on WHKY TV News this evening, as he does every month, is District Attorney David Lerner, who is the DA for Burke, Caldwell, and Catawba Counties, the 25th District. And Mr. Lerner, it's always great to have you in. Well, Rob, always good to see you, sir. And uh, I, I thank you for having me on. I've got a handful of cases here, if you'd like to hear about some of those. Yeah, go over uh, some of the cases in the past month. Okay, well, uh, Timothy Carl Maynor, 51 years of age, uh, we convicted him of uh, possession of a firearm by a felon, and that was a jury trial. We have a lot of jury trials here. He, we also convict him of habitual felon status, and he has gone to prison for six to eight years. Um, Morganton Mann's gonna spend at least seven years in prison for two counts of possession of a firearm by a felon and admission of habitual felon status. David Allen Pearson, 48, sentenced to seven to 10 years in prison. Um, we had a self-defense shooting recently up in Caldwell County where um, a man has been cleared of any wrongdoing in that uh, particular instance. He, he had to act to defend his life and he did and uh, the individual that got killed was involved in drugs, had drugs in them, was, um, you know, had a propensity for violence and just ended up um, he, he finally got shot. And in these cases an investigation, a thorough investigation yes. is done after the yes. shooting by officers and by the DA's office. That's correct, that's correct and after all that we uh, cleared this individual, returned his gun to him. Uh, let's see, David William Connor, 26 years of age, we convicted him of second degree sex offense and solicitation of a minor by computer, two counts of third degree sexual exploitation, he's gone to prison five to eleven years, another child molester. Uh, Robert Sean Holloway, 46 years of age, uh, he is going to prison for indecent liberties with a child, indecent exposure, and uh, again, another habitual felon. So five to 11 years in prison, good riddance to him. We don't need people like that on our streets or around our children. I'm, I'm proud to be able to be in a position to send somebody like that to prison. Here's Anthony Robertson, 51 years of age, uh, convicted him of trafficking heroin, six to eight years in prison. Brandon Edward Colburn, 30 years of age, uh, attempted trafficking of opium, heroin, three to five years in prison. We're really serious about trying to get these drugs off our streets as well as, as these um, child molesters. And the other one I had for you is Brandon Shane Loudermilk, 40 years of age, has gone to prison for uh, methamphetamine sale and possession. He's uh, got a three to five year sentence in prison. Again, another, another dope dealer. And that was a Burke County case. Yes, it was. That one was, yes. Mr. Lerner, thank you for coming in, and uh, we'll talk to you again next month. Rob, thank you so much. David Lerner, the district attorney, going over some cases from the past month. And now back to you, Ralph, here on WHKY TV News.